So Perfectos Desconocidos, the Mexican version directed by Manolo Caro, was actually the first version of this film that I saw. For one thing, I speak Spanish relatively well, and for another, this film is pretty easy to find. If you go to the IMDb, it's listed as available on Amazon Prime, at least for now, and it's a quick watch, just like the original at just over an hour and a half. Perfectos Desconocidos is in many ways seemingly a carbon copy of Perfectos Desconocidos' script, with the major differences, I would say, being visual and tonal. Visually, the camera is almost peering into the dinner party at Ava and Antonio's. We get long zooms taking us into the room around Antonio and Ava's apartment, as if we were spying in from the outside. Likewise, we get lots of long pans around the dinner table with the camera, with a sense of everything happening in real time, rather than in cuts. Along with the more probing camera work, the music here is a bit more sinister than the Italian version's more melancholy score. There's an air of intrigue to the whole proceedings, and a sense of potential danger to it. Throughout the Italian version, there's definitely tension and sadness, but never a sense of the threat of violence between these friends, whereas that threat definitely seems more on the table here as the revelations and betrayals mount up. Similar to the Italian version, the Mexican version has the same twist ending. However, the sadness of that ending is less clear here, with more upbeat and up-tempo music towards the end. The Mexican version could more easily be classified as a very dark comedy versus the Italian version. This version feels more like it could be a play also, as there are fewer camera cuts and more of a sense of the events unfolding out mostly in the dining room. In fact, Perfectos Desconocidos has been performed with multiple adaptations in theatrical performances in Spanish language countries. So I'd like to get a sense of where this film fits into Mexican cinema and Mexican culture. I'm going to try to talk to someone at the Mexican Cultural Institute of New York.